we're gonna look at your double leg calf raises. So for this, you want something where you can just have a little bit of support. It can be a dining room chair, kitchen worktop, it doesn't matter, because this is not about balance. And the aim of this is that we're coming vertically or relatively vertically. So it's not a forward and up, you're not trying to use your hips to hike yourself up. But I want you to just stand there, just wiggle your toes, and you should feel that weight sort of somewhere in the middle of your foot. Now, we're coming up onto your toes, which means you do have to shift your weight forward a little bit. So if I say to you, feel the balls of your feet a little bit more, can you still wiggle your toes? And there's a little tiny bit of lightness in your heels. So we're not heel heavy on this, but it's not a lean forward, okay? So there's a nice little bit of difference. So just be there again, be upright, feel the weight in the middle, and then just ever so gently shift the weight forward just a touch. From there, use your hands for a little bit of support. Can you press into the balls of your feet to start to lift off? Stay here. When you're at the top, can you wiggle your toes? If you can wiggle your toes and you're not gripping on for dear life, you know you've used a little bit more calf. And then just let yourself come back down again. Let your heels kiss the floor, and then we come back up again. So your toes are staying on the floor, but they're light, they're adaptable, they're adjustable, and your heels are just coming up and down. Those knees are staying relatively straight so that we've got that really lovely spring the whole way up our body. And your hand is just giving you that little bit of support. You're feeling almost like you're rolling through your foot and the ball of that foot, particularly that big toe, is taking that weight. So we're coming up as far as you feel you can. You're not locking out into the front of your ankles. You're staying a little bit lower than that and then controlling it back down again. So just do a few more there. Again, feeling like you're rolling, almost like a caterpillar through your feet. And we'll make this one your last one. Again, it should feel relatively straight up and straight down. And then when you've done that last one, shake it off. And well done, there's your double leg calf raise.